Uh, Chris parked in heaven, was really good in the heats. Yeah, she was, mate. She um, surprised me a bit. She's probably been down on form a little bit. and um, Yeah, probably hasn't had a great month overall. You know, had a few things go wrong and um, whatever. But, yeah, no, she put the right foot forward today, which was, um, yeah, really pleasing. Uh, when you needed her to go, she really responded for you. That's a good sign going into a, you know, now, now auto qualified for the final. Yeah, definitely. I think that's probably one of her main assets. You know, she's got great speed and follows the speed so well. So, yeah, it was pleasing to see her do that again and, um, yeah, really find the line well. So what do you do now? To, obviously, a final's a week away or a bit over a week away. What do you do now? Oh, not too much. She's, um, yeah, she sort of tends to look after herself pretty well. So, um, yeah, you know, just, you know, keep ticking her over, try and keep her fit, healthy and happy and, yeah, hopefully get a good draw. And uh, thoughts on, on chances in that final? Yeah, you know, they're probably a pretty even bunch, you know. It didn't look like there was any standouts throughout the series. Um, obviously, Muscle Bart and uh, even Gordon's Bay and Joe the Bookie, they're probably probably the top three or four horses, really. But, you know, between the rest of us, there doesn't seem to be a hell of a lot. So, um, like I said, you know, we can come up with a decent draw. Um, they'll know she's there.